Yu-Gi-Oh! What is up YouTube? This is Jeremy from Team Bio and today guys we are doing another 2 o'clock in the morning pack opening for you guys. So some of you have commented on one of my previous videos where it was like it was titled Shh Late Night Pack Opening. Well we are doing another one because I have just gotten off work. It's about 2 o'clock, 2 or 3 in my local time and uh, I finally got my case of Toon Chaos. Uh, I'm still waiting on my Eternity Code case, which is kind of upsetting. Uh, I've been talking to the guy. He said, oh yeah, if we don't get it in, we'll give you a full refund. He's a really trusted seller, so I'm not too worried about it. But as soon as we do get that case in, I will be doing a case opening of it. But as for now, we did manage to get our Toon Chaos box on time. So we're going to do another late night opening of it. Um, Yeah, I'll be honest, I have not seen or watched, I guess, any other YouTuber open it. I know there's videos of it right now, like, all, everyone's opening it, but I haven't really opened or watched them just because I want to kind of, I don't know, feel the surprise firsthand. Um, I, I do know that the, yep, packs have different artworks. Uh, yeah. Sorry, guys. 16-hour shifts, gonna kill you. Let's see, are these all the same? No, they're not. So we're going to separate these. We're going to use uh, which side will do better. Uh, Black Lizard Soldier or the Chaos Creator. But um, cards I am looking for out of this set, uh, honestly, not too many. However, I would love to see, uh, well, there's a lot of BLS packs. I would love to get a collector's rare version of Black Luster Soldier, the original one, because I don't know if you guys saw it, but a while ago I did make a top 10 cards that I think deserve to be an ultimate rare, and Black Luster Soldier actually was one of those cards, now being a collector's rare, so we'll just hop into the packs. Um, <laughs> there are significantly less creator packs than BLS, uh, so we'll just go through a couple of these. I do know there is... Seven cards in a pack, uh, all the cards except for one are going to be a rare, and you are guaranteed a hollow, which is micro code for our first hollow. And Pod Desires, that's pretty cool. I still actually have the game promo pack sealed for uh, whatever that game was called that it came out of. Totally forgot. Let's see. Magician of Hope. Pot another Pod of Desires. Um, other cards I would be looking forward to this is the Toon cards. I actually love Toons, uh, but though, who doesn't? Let's see, Ex Exocator Equivit? What is this? A third Pot of Desires, okay. <laughs> so I'm starting to think Pot of Desires isn't guaranteed in all the BLS packs? Question mark? Um, cards I would like though is a uh, Pot of Extravagance 2. Uh, any of the tune cards that are new. Number 75, G Bamboozling Gossip Shadow. That's a pretty cool reprint, actually. Um, I like to think that I single-handedly got Ronga Mini at Band with my 6 Samurai Rongo deck, utilizing Bamboozling Gossip Shadow, which I still have my two copies of. But it's nice that it's reprinted. That's pretty cool. Master of Dion, Magician Hope, Stardust Dragons in here too. That'd be a pretty cool collection for to get. Envoy of Chaos, uh, Toon World too. Nice. Again, guys, <laughs> it's 2 o'clock in the morning. 16 hour day shift. I'm not going to be too energetic. Cypher and Driver, Keeper of Dragon Magic, Frightfur, Meister. I know, uh,. Fluffle Angels in here, and that's been. I think the OCG has had that for what years now. Toon Harpy Lady for our first Toon card that we got out of here. That's really cool. She's pretty, pretty cool artwork, or I guess not cool. It's a pretty cute artwork. I like that. It makes me smile. <laughs> uh, Chaos Zone Sangan is an unnecessary reprint, but whatever and i guess which is the black horse movement like, why didn't they put sandwich in here actually or sandwich that would have been perfect 
Uh, Gear Breed. Another Toon Harpy Lady, nice. Alyssa Gasm. I do not like seeing that as a rare, but I hate the card anyways. Ooh, uh, speaking of Gear Freed, getting the uh, Immortal Phoenix Gear Freed as either just the Ultra or even the Collector's Rare would be really cool too. Well, uh, <laughs> um, <laughs> nice, <laughs> I guess. Um, I don't know if you guys can see that too well, but we got the fingerprint foil. Um, if you guys don't get the joke, it's just something I saw in Zodiac Duelist, which, I don't know, I just thought it was funny, but <laughs> try to get it that a little closer. Um, first box out of 12, and we get, <laughs> that's crazy, guys. Oh, I like that texture. I know you're not really supposed to touch the picture, but that feels really nice. This is actually another card I would not mind getting, um... I'm honestly an awestruck about... <laughs> That's crazy, guys. So, Chaos Space, if you guys don't know, is a really crazy card. I'll just read the card's effect word for word. Um, send one light or dark monster from your hand to the graveyard. That is a cost. Add one light or dark monster uh, that cannot be normal summoned or set from your deck to your hand with a level between four and eight. So you can have, like, your Black Luster Soldier, your... Um, Ah, your Chaos Emperor Dragon. What's the other one in here? Is... Alright, I lost interest. Uh, Light Pulsar Dragon you can add, as long as you discard the opposite uh, attribute. Um, but yeah, you add a, with an attribute that's different than that. Uh, you can banish this card from your graveyard and target one of your banished light or dark monsters. That cannot be normal summoned or set, so again, like a Black Luster Soldier or Light Pulsar or whatever. Or even your baby dragons, I forgot. Clop Servant and Wyvern Buster. Uh, place that monster on the bottom of your deck and then draw a card. So that's pretty crazy. And it's even more crazy that we got fingerprint foil in the first box. Ethan, I'm sorry, bud. You told me to go home and to go to bed. But no. So I'll get a sleeve for that, actually. Um, I lied. I am nowhere near sleeves. Wow, guys, we still have all of these packs. And we haven't even gotten Ultra Rare. I'm sorry, I'm dragging this on. Thank you guys if you're still watching this at, like, and not skipping through it. Black Lost Soldier, Magician of Hope, Chaos Emperor Dragon. Ooh, Mud Dragon of Souls. That's, kind of, that's actually kind of a cool reprint. Chaos Space, guys. That's crazy. It's a Collector's Rare. I still have 11 more boxes to open. Mass Hero Acid. Uh, kind of an odd addition, but I understand. It, has, it hasn't been reprinted ever. It's from, I think, I want to say it's a 2011 uh, promo 10. Cypher from Gear Gamma would be a really cool collector's rare to get. A, also, another go Gossip Shadow. Where's our Ultras go? Witch of the Black Forest, Sublimination Knight, so I hope I pronounced that right. Oh, made a rhyme. I'm a poet, didn't know it. Haha, <laughs> terrible puns. It's late. Uh, Supervise, Chaos, Chaos Sorcerer, that's another thing I was thinking about that you can use with a Chaos Space and Chaos Valkyrie. You can't use her with Chaos Space, but, um, oh yeah, you can actually. Because she can't be normal or special or normal summoner set. All right, so uh, obviously Black Luster Soldier, the Toon Black Luster Soldier pack is going to win, unless we pull four ultra rares or something. Because I think Chaos Space is like a two hundred dollar card, maybe more, maybe less. I have no clue. I just know they're quite expensive for the uh, collector's rares. So let's see if uh the uh, other Chaos side can do well. Valkyrie Sigrun? I still want some tomb cards. Tomb bookmark would be dope. Uh, BLS. Tomb page flip. That's actually, that's actually the card I was thinking of, not bookmark. I mean, bookmark's really good too, but this is the one that special summons uh, 
or that you reveal three tune monsters with different names, special summon one of them from your deck, ignoring that there were so many conditions. Shuffle the rest into the deck, and it's a quick split, quick play spell. This card is nuts. I'm so upset I don't have any sleeves right near me right now. Um, our box has been pretty crazy. Jeez. Uh, if you guys would like a tune deck profile, please let me know, because I'm not a meta player, but, I, but I'm really good with terrible decks. I can make bad decks play decently. Valkyrie something again. So if you'd like a tune deck profile, hit that thumbs up button, comment down below, tell me if you guys would like it or not. Chances are it's going to happen anyways, but I'd like the reassurance. Chaos Space as a regular super- oh, it all, it's only a super rare. Huh. Interesting. I thought it'd be a higher rare. I thought it was going to be an ultra rare. Obviously, I haven't looked into the set too much aside from tombs. Oh, it's damaged right out of the pack. Can you guys see that? That kind of sucks. Oh, hey. <laughs> the Chaos Creator side. Alright, so... That's a nice ultra rare to get. So I wonder if we, since we got a collector's rare, if that's going to take up our spot. Oh, sorry about that bump. If it's going to take up our spot for the uh, the ultra rares. I hope not. We got five more packs. Sephiroth Driver. Eternal Chaos. Curse of Dragon. Chaos Space again. Okay. So we got a place out of those. Just one is quite a bit more than the other. The other two, I should say. Oh my god. <laughs> this is honestly the craziest box, guys. Like... I don't think it can get better. Pot of Extravagance, Collector's Rare, Toon uh, Page Flip, Chaos Creator, multiple Pot of Desires. Guys, this box is insane. I'm not... Uh, I wish I was not so tired so I could be more energetic. I'm going to have to rub it in my buddy's face when, when I finish recording. Right for Sabertooth is actually a really good reprint too. Uh, oops, the wrong side. I think it's only had one printing prior to this. I could be wrong. I don't think it was Infusion Enforcers. But uh, I know how to printing a while ago from Secrets of Eternity, I want to say. Alright, let's see what we can get in our last pack. I have no complaints. I'm not going to ask for anything in particular. But can we get something relatively cool? And this guy, I have no clue how to pronounce his name, and I do not want to try again. So that is going to be it for uh, this box opening, guys. Um, it is, let's see, it's about 2.16, 2.17 in the morning. I am done for tonight. I will open up more packs tomorrow. So thank you guys so much for watching the video. Remember to like the video, comment down below, subscribe to the channel. Um, share the channel with your friends. This this was amazing, so I, just so you guys know, Collector's Rare does not take up a slot for your, uh, what's it called? That's always for your Ultra Rare. So you can still get your three Ultra Rares, and ours were absolutely absurd, and still get a Collector's Rare. That's crazy. So again, thank you guys so much for watching the video, and I will talk to you guys later. Recognize when I wreck a mic, leaving all y'all mesmerized Killing instrumentals, but nobody wanna testify In his prime, I think someone better check the guy Always spit and eat the beat, gon' be hard to identify Stress minds and wreck mics and leave with the best lines My sex life is great cause I spit like a tech nine Stalk competition, beat them with the lead pipe Sleep on you rappers just like it's my bedtime You already know that old big pearl from the west side Got you hoes smoking on my flow like a meth pipe Forever cold, I'll eat your soul like a death sight Headed to the top, shining brighter than a headlight You better wreck Nice. I'm about to go off, putting on a show when I ain't even trying to show off Here's the red dot, the shot, and kill Rudolph Call me James Bond, cause I killed it with a suit on